And we continue with <gasps> EA's press conference. Here we go. Alright, so far. Spanish Inquisition. <laughs> no one be expecting it. <laughs> Ten years of Damn Christian. Almost a year ago now, I stepped in to help lead our studio into a next generation, which begins. Do you know what Dragon, Dragon Age is? Inquisition. Yeah. Yeah, We're dragons. creating a new RPG uh, experience. Oh my God. For the first time, <laughs> we'll explore a vast So, Dragon world. Age one is... This is not only affect the story, but will also change the world. Mass of Effect. Effect. You'll need an Inquisition Kinda. to restore order by the same to people. a world in turmoil. Yeah. Okay. And You'll make diverse and Does it have this is an, dialogue trees new, like Mass Effect did? I haven't played it. I've wanted to for a while. Dragon Age Inquisition will launch in the fall of 2014. We're taking the time to a deep, captivating experience for you. With that, there's two here's of them, the right? first glimpse. Two of the so next far. This is the third. The third. In our but first it seems fashionable nowadays not to use numbers in your title yeah. anymore. Yes, yes, or you yes. Just make up whatever number you want. These guys are I've totally pumped. So here's a CG you teaser. It's gonna be gorgeous. None shall be untouched by the fires Nom. above. None. Nom. That's a guns and swords. Yep. What? Oh, he's a oh, that jawline. Battle weary soldier. But so Faith piercings. <laughs> lies in ashes. Maybe you went to ye olde hot topic. <laughs> hot topic pierces? How fragile alliances. Yeah. God. What don't Ooh. they do? Crumble to dust. Have dignity. So <laughs> as this world <laughs> is torn. Style of their own. <laughs> Sorry. Their options. Rights to what they print. <laughs> this segment's called Fashion Hot Topics. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck the hot topics. It is now. Burning down the yeah. hot topics. <laughs> I could have probably got this. Whoa, what's the aliens? What the hell are all these things? Super excited about these people on screen. Who's going to have hot aliens and dragons? I see the dragons, Ooh. but I don't see the age. When so you guys like her? She's cool. Is that a surprise she appeared? Was she supposed it's to be dead? I don't know. I have no idea. She's probably supposed to be dead. That'd be a cool little twist. No, they're going nuts. Um, aliens is like some portal opening in them getting here rather than space travel, they're and they're kind of medieval too. <laughs> so, yes, yeah, surprise. That's so yeah, cool. Like Thor. Over a year Someone else said not surprise. Remember when we found out Thor was an alien? <laughs> oh. Didn't that just throw you for a loop? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, now. Nice. Cut, cut. In the yeah. section, this is gonna last a while. You know what I should have done? You know what? I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna reorder this. I'm gonna lead. If you're watching this on YouTube, this is gonna fuck you up. But I'm gonna lead with the Dragon Age, and then break out, and then combine it with the Need for Speed segment. And I'm gonna come back. Hey buddies, welcome back to the EA press conference. Let's move this thing along. Nope. Here's a teaser for a brand new game from EA. We well, can see Peggle. This one was yeah, pieced together it. from the dead bones of another game we thought was coming. Oh really? Oh. Maybe. Peggle? Yes, I don't know. Star Wars? Oh! oh! <laughs> nice. Yes! Oh, Star Wars Battlefront. Yeah. Those games are great. Do you think? What? No, no, it's yeah. not. It has nothing to do with the other one, but the other one is dead. Yeah, I know. We've lost oh, really? it forever, yeah. Yeah, yeah. sucks. No, man, but Battlefront's fun. Yeah. We are that doesn't make it any better that we lost the one where you play as Boba Fett. Yeah. In a dirty, un yeah. seedy underbelly, like a gritty... You play as Boba Fett in that one? Yes. You were, I didn't even know that! You were going to play as Boba Fett. Hunting down people in a seedy, oh. seedy city in Star well, that, Wars that's universe. That's sort of like a the redo first you have to spend uh, a thousand years this are like that. They, they there was another one for maybe 360 that was that, and it was oh, almost really? open world right. and it was really cool, but you know, not quite there yet. Would have been amazing uh, until would have been. then Disney Fuck. bought yeah, Lucas and Arts and yeah. disbanded them. There shall be no and violent now, games. Now Disney sells the rights to lot uh, to Star Wars to companies like EA instead of Lucas Arts making it, like they have yeah. for. Yeah. Three decades now? You can't catch Dell's really Kind just. of a uh, shitty turn. I am not you. I'm the life you're too scared to live. I'm the reality Why? show. Is that car talking to me? Yeah. 
telling you that you should buy it. You know what? why I do this? Because you're a girl. You don't. He's on the car. I will never stop. Baby. You will never catch me. You not stop. will make me famous. You will fail. Kick. Eject the football. Yes, Michael. I want a play game where a car is egging you on to run from the car. Come on, man. Let me loose. Just bump them. Feel the juices. Come on, open it up! <laughs> you gave up home ownership for this. <laughs> the wife and kids left you for me. <laughs> let me go, let me breathe. Somebody on uh, who was mic'd up was talking over it on stage there. <laughs> yeah, it was oh, kind of confusing. Really? Hi, and welcome to a new generation of Need for Speed. Led by Ghost Games, ES New Studio. In Need for Speed <laughs> Rivals, everything starts with the ultimate rivalry between cops it's right. the thing, I guess, to so you can't play dress casual, game, business casual for yeah. these things. It is most of them are. Like that we are revolutionary I want to see a guy in a three-piece come out. Well, 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 that's yeah. Miyamoto yeah. for it. Yeah. Iwata. Yeah. Iwata. Yeah. Iwata. Iwata. Oh, Iwata. Iwata did. Miyamoto. Yeah, I want full tuxedo. And it gives you one world, and you choose how to experience it. Play it alone. Or Duster. With friends and rivals. And a beater. Where your race is in chases. Duster. Duster. Duster beater. Duster shades and leather pants. No, Duster in a mesh shirt. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, I'm to show you uh, a fluorescent like. pink mesh shirt. It's the criterion. And Capri. Like, like a heavy Capri. leather <laughs> Duster. <laughs> and Ghost Games, Lee Sonny, James Mouet. All right, so they're going to play a little bit of this. I'm going to fast forward because we all know what Need for Speed looks like. I used to really love Need for Speed. It's quite a lot of fun, in fact. I fucking love Need for Speed. And I think this is going to be another open world-ish one. They're kind of pumping them out, it feels like. like yeah. we've I have no idea releases. how many there's been. And it and looks and almost... Am I correct in saying that it's not co-op again? Oh, you mean split screen? Split screen. Sorry. I don't know. They made some statement recently that it kind of sounded like they were going to try to... Bad, Aaron Paul. Return. Breaking Bad. Breaking Bad. Oh, shit. Aaron Paul. Oh, nice. Oh, because he's in a movie for Need for Speed. You know, oh, really? Um, yeah. Oh, really? Myself, Basic, really Need for cool Speed, the movie, is basically going to try to take on, you You can get, um, fucking Fast and Furious uh, type movies. Uh, yeah. Right. yeah. Here at E3 to share a peek behind the scenes at our movie, Need for Speed. Just like the game, we're looking to give you an adrenaline rush that puts you on the edge of your seat. For the first few months, I've been racing around in some of the hottest cars in the world, including Deadly. this custom Ford Mustang, my car in the movie. So let's take a look, enjoy, um, and have a great E3. Bitches! <laughs> I think I liked him better before when I thought he was only acting that way. Yeah. <laughs> only acting what, what way? Kind of Just that kind of that way. Real I've seen him in interviews and he seems like a yeah. casual normal dude. A casual normal dude? Okay, yeah. so he's putting it on to have the attitude that's necessary for Need for Speed today. Well, he probably got a lot of money for that day. You know what? Fuck the Mustang! I just saw a Bugatti! Yeah. Fuck the Mustang! Ooh, nice. Whoa, they did that! I love how much like just frames of cars there are you can see. in the seat and let you drive at 230 miles an hour. Holy shit. Cool. That's just crazy. I wonder how much their insurance was for the logistics of all of this. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> was Bucket. that the Bugatti he hit? No, it wasn't, was it? Cool. I don't, know why I don't keep up enough. Bugattis look like they've changed. I Probably might have been completely wrong. They all look very similar to me. I only really know it from the front, that little circle yeah. on the front. Um, I thought that segment was longer. It wasn't. <laughs> it sure wasn't. All right. Well, thank God. To make that a segment. What was at the beginning of it? Uh, Battlefront and then a little bit of Need for Speed. Yeah. <laughs> I kind of fast forwarded. Let's just make this one a little mishmash. Is everything coming together? Yeah. Uh, 